Left on their own, tenants at a Sarasota apartment complex say their property manager evacuated without securing their buildings. Doors left unlocked, unboarded, and loose items strewn across the development. Residents don't know if it's even safe to stay, and that's when they knew they'd better call Bankin. Investigator Shannon Bankin joins me now. This is a pretty scary scenario if you think about sort of hunkering down in your home and you don't know if it's a safe place to be. That's right, and these residents, they've been watching everything that we've been telling people to do, and they say that their complex has done none of these things, making them even more vulnerable to this massive storm. Yes. Greg yeah, Van Fleet is the unofficial I mean, spokesman for Applegate Apartments. This is our lives. This is not, you know, we're having an issue, not getting something fixed. This is our lives. This is our homes. You know, this is our community. Van Fleet says the property manager promised to secure the complex, then boarded up the office and took off. We've got 20 year old kids that live here. We've got uh, 65 year old people here living here, and they need to be safe. I found mattresses, a couch, trash cans, traffic cones, even this. So, yeah, it's. It shakes. Uh, He's worried about these massive windows and door. And check this out, tape over the lock to Van Fleet's building. So anybody can just open this at any time and walk in your place. Anyone or Irma. The head of Sarasota EOC was not pleased. They didn't put shutters up. They left projectiles all over the property. It's it's dangerous situation. Uh, it, they should contact the apartment managers or the, the oh property manager, somebody to try to do that or do whatever they can themselves within reason and safety. Bottom line? If they don't feel safe in that structure, they need to go to one of our shelters. I've left messages for the company that owns this complex, Ram Partners LLC in Atlanta, and I was told that someone would call me back before airtime tonight, but that hasn't happened yet. I mean, time is running out here. What are these residents going to do? Well, you know, I spoke to EOC about that, and they said that they should try to, you know, secure their belongings the best they can, but they're probably going to have to go to a shelter because, you know, safety is at utmost here. But, of course, they want to protect their belongings. I can understand mm -hmm. it both ways. All right. Yeah. Thank you very much, right. Shannon.